All right, we're rolling. Hello, everyone. Uh, a few people have been asking me about my gear choices and you know, how I've been preparing for the trail. Uh, I just want to make a quick video on uh, everything that I purchased and put together in the last few weeks and months, and just to show you what I'll be carrying on my back and what I'll be working with. So let's get started. All right, so I picked up this 65 liter Osprey backpack. Uh, it's super nice. This it is it mesh back to, to keep me from uh, sweating while I'm hiking. Uh, a lot of compartments, a lot of space. I, I really like it. And then I also got this for Christmas. It was a three liter water sack attached to this hose. Uh, all in all, it's a good bag. It fits well. I also picked up this um, rain cover for my backpack for when it starts to rain real hard. Uh, moving on to my sleeping systems. Uh, I got this sleeping bag. I've had this for 10 years and bought this bag to get it a lot smaller. It's a down marmot sleeping bag. Uh, that and my Thermarest sleeping pad. Uh, practice, or not practice, I went out a few times, practice with my gear and use this and it worked real well. I also have a thermal blanket in there uh, just to add, add a layer of insulation between the ground and I. Uh, here's a tarp, I picked this up, it was like a dollar thirty at REI. Uh, it was it's one of those last minute purchases to, for an extra layer of insulation. Got these poles, uh, black diamond, got this from Christmas from my sister, thanks Mira. Uh, they're super nice. They're extendable. Uh, haven't you know gone out and played with them much, but match them to my height, and and uh, they work pretty well. <laughs> so moving on here, this is my bag of extra clothing. We'll go over to here. And uh, clothing is the biggest place where I ended up saving a lot of weight in the end. But. Uh, so here's a bag of extra clothing. Basically everything I'm going to walk you through, there's an extra pair of all that in here. And uh, and it worked out pretty well. So I have uh, uh, three layers I'll be wearing at a time. we got the base layer, basically a t-shirt. Mid layer, long sleeve, zip up neck. And then an outer layer, heavy layer, which I have this down jacket. And on top of that I have a rain jacket for, for bad weather and extra wind protection. Uh, as far as the, the legs go, uh, it's about the same principle, three layers, base, long mid layer, and then an outer layer, easy dry. Um, moving on to gloves, I got two pairs. I got this thin uh, liner that, that I could be wearing probably daily, and uh, then a heavier one for when it gets colder, and, and they're, they're waterproof, so my hands will stay dry while I'm hiking. I got to pick this bandana, just a little extra towel slash something to, to wear. Uh, this this hat I bought, or not bought, it was actually given to me. Um, it's one of the only things that I'm bringing extra that, that I don't really need. Uh, I think it's cool. It has little flappy ears to it, and it keeps my head warm. Uh, moving on to shoes, or quickly, let's cover these. I also brought a hat and, and a neck warmer, which I can also use as a hat need be um, keep me protected from the wind moving on to shoes I brought these stylish pair of Crocs the other day these are going to be my camp shoes uh, they're rubber so they won't retain any water and they'll dry real quick and then here are my hiking boots shoes they're a hybrid of trail or they're called trail runners they're a hybrid between a boot and a running shoe uh, they'll dry quick because they're made of mesh and They'll keep my feet pretty dry. Uh, moving on, let's see. What other extra goodies do I got? Move over here to my tent system. Uh, I got a two-person tent. It's a Force 2 tent. Uh, I got to I push it down into this dry sack, so it's pretty compactable. Poles, uh, spikes, patch kit for my sleeping pad as well as the tent. Uh, Here's uh, an extra rope that I need for my bear bag system. Uh, I guess we can move over to food then. Uh, here's my 
bag that I'll be keeping food in. Uh, food and my cooking system, cooking utensils. Uh, this weighs about eight pounds with all my food in it. I'll, I'll make a separate video of my my day by day breakdown of food if you're interested. <clears throat> Let's see. Moving on, water. Everyone in the AT has to somehow sanitize their water. Uh, I chose the filter system, Sawyer Mini. Uh, it's pretty easy to use and quick. Uh, you just get a collect the water in a dirty bag, push it through the filter, and then you have your clean bag. So I have a, li a liter of clean water and then a three liter in my backpack, which I talked about earlier. <clears throat> so that should be plenty of water to have between water sources. Um, have a little med kit, uh, band-aids, medicine, that kind of stuff. Uh, moving on to this, this is like toiletries, just uh, Purell, uh, soap, soap sheets, uh, deodorant, there's some bug spray in here, toothpaste, toothbrush. Uh, moving on to electronics, I'm going to be bringing my GoPro, which I'm filming on right now. Uh, the cables for it, I got this headlamp, uh, duct tape lighter, extra batteries. Uh, this thing's pretty cool. It's a mirror and uh, an extra battery charger, which charged my phone about 50%. That's pretty cool. Um, I got this towel here. Uh, it absorbs, I got it from REI. It absorbs eight times its weight and dries real quick. That'll be really, really useful when I'm out there. But other than that, I think I've covered everything. Um, oh, yeah, well, skip this stuff. I'll be wearing my glass, bringing my glasses in a hard case. And then uh, the David Miller Guide to the AT, which uh, most people, from what I hear, use on the trail. It has a ton of information. Almost every step is logged in here about where you find water, shelter, food, resupply areas. Uh, and then just the kind of final things. Uh, I got my wallet. I bought this Travex wallet. Holds all my stuff in here, slides in and out. Cash, cards, that kind of thing. Got my hiking watch, compass, barometer, altimeter, sunrise and sunset times, uh, world clock, all those good things. But uh, yeah, I think that's all for this video. And uh, we'll go over to my food and check that out.